Hey there, dragons. I'm Benjamin. And I'm Riley. And today is April the 11th. Welcome to Dragon TV. Woohoo! All dragons, it's a couple days after prom and I'm still kind of loopy. But the one cure to my condition will always be snow cones. Lucky for you, a place opened not long ago. Cooper did a story over it. Let's check it out. <laughs> nice. Being flavored ice with the love of Jesus Christ. Big Mo's just opened and we decided to check it out. Be here for the community and share the love of Jesus with everyone because that's very important for us. What is Big Mo's, you might ask? Big Mo's is um, a shaved ice, snow cone, whatever you want to call it. Um, we have all different flavors and all kinds of stuff. Probably wondering where this unique name came from. Our last name is Morgan, and whenever our children play sports, we always say, Go Big Mo! So that's where Big Mo's came from. <laughs> we wanted to do something for the community, <laughs> and uh, we just couldn't decide. And since there's no buildings or anything here, um, we decided to give the girl that owned this a call and she was selling it and we were able to buy it and get it all sorted. They have so many new and crazy flavors you can try. Blue raspberry, blue bubble gum, blue coconut, white coconut, regular cherry, Granny Smith apple, a Georgia peach, cotton candy, a grape. My favorite flavor is strawberry cheesecake with cream. Right now, we are open Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday from 2.30 to 8.30. So we're closed on Wednesdays and Sundays. That's Serving pretty. flavored ice, the love of Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, that There's one pickle. You know, Riley, I've been seeing a lot of bad students lately, and I don't really like it. Uh, tell me about it. I think Ms. Davis is doing something about it. Let's see what her students did. Hey, uh, you're not doing that right. Uh, yes I am. Uh, no, you're not. Oh my god, you're so stupid. You're stupid. I cannot work with him. Hey, uh, I think you might be doing that wrong. Thanks for letting me know. Yeah, no problem. Be nice to your classmates, kids. Can I have some? Hey, Ms. Davis, can I eat in your class? Yes, you may. Hey, can I have some? Aaron. Present. Luke. Luke. Here. Bailey. Bailey. Bailey! What? <laughs> Aaron. Present. Luke. Here. Bailey. Here. And it's a great day to be a dragon. Bless you. Thank you. Remember, kids, when in the classroom environment, don't be trashy, be classy. <laughs> Oh, I got on my pants. <laughs> 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 What's up, my brother from another mother? Man, it's been a super lit day up in this his house. You know what I'm talking about? What are you doing? Come on, it's my slang, man. YOLO. 
That is not our slang. In fact, we have a whole video about it. Just, just roll it. Yeet. Stop. <laughs> T as in T-E-A. Um, like the tea I drink. T? T-E-A? Texas Education Agency? Maybe that means you're sweet. Uh, tell me, uh, tell me everything that you know about it. Gossip. Extra means it's just a little extra special. Maybe you look a little extra fashionable. Um, positive? Really, really nice, special. Extra. Okay, like my daughter was extra. Doing more than what is required. Finsta, like a gangsta. I feel like I should be throwing gang sign. I don't know. <laughs> I'm too old for that. <laughs> Finsta? You're on the fence? I don't have to be a gangsta, but now he's a fenster. <laughs> I thought you said I'm fenced to do that. Or, yeah. Fake Instagram. Gucci means you are looking fabulous. You spent a lot of money on your outfit. Gucci, very fashionable. Like stylish or expensive or? Uh, good. That's cool. That would be like a good looking gentleman. And Miss Knight likes Orlando Bloom because I'm 45 and that would be my snack toy. Is try to get from my room snacks? Like uh, potato chips? <laughs> Food. That good looking. Goat, like get your goat, make you mad, irritate you. Oh, greatest of all time. So annoying. Uh, the best. Greatest of all time, Miss Mullins. Mm-hmm, dog ate my homework, sus. Mm-hmm. Suspect. Okay, you sus. Spell it, please. S-U-S. Use it in a sentence. Like, uh, I have no idea. I don't know. Do you believe in life after love? What are you doing? I'm getting ready for Dragon Idol. But Jawad and Kobe already did it. It's too late. So you're saying I missed my chance? Yep. That's all for this episode. Thanks for watching. It's, it's a, a lit day. day to be a dragon. It's a great day. Just stop. Well, dragons, a couple days after Brom. Brom. Took an L. Uh, <laughs> what many students do on my history tests. <laughs> Keep walking forward. No, 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 no. Keep walking forward. I don't trust you. Keep walking, Keep walking forward. Am I supposed to be the one that gets more up? Mm -hmm. You're already getting more up. <laughs> <laughs> Can't even. Can't even. Um, that's all my students um, right before spring break. And Miss Knight, too, really. Like the original Willy Wonka when they're interviewing Augustus Gloop, his dad's eating and they point a microphone at his dad and he eats the microphone. Fair. All right. Do the intro. Perfect. What is Schminglebop? Well, Schminglebop is an every item tool that can get the grime off of your car. Can be used as a jackhammer. A Schminglebop can can do anything. It can even make blueberry muffins. It can make blueberry. You can even eat it. Turns the grime into blueberry muffins. Yep. Yummy. Yep. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right.